In this video, I walk you through how to make a single product sales page only with Gutenberg blocks. If this interests you, keep watching. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If you don't know who I am, I am naturally, I'm from Portugal. In this channel, I talk about all things related to WordPress websites. The theme I'm using is the blank canvas. This blank theme is a free minimalist theme for single page websites. It's a child theme of Seedlet, another free theme by Automatic. It's single posts and page layouts have no header, navigation menus, so the page you design in the WordPress editor is the same page you will see on the front end. As for plugins, I only have one plugin installed to add testimonials to my page. What I want to do now is to create a new page for my product page. One of the great things about this theme is that you don't need to worry about a title for your page. Inside the blog editor, I open the list view tool, select the patterns tab. I want this to be built with block patterns. A block pattern is a pre-made design layout ready to be used in your posts and pages. They are made up of WordPress blocks. In the drop-down menu, enter blank canvas to find out the block patterns that come with the theme. Use the explore button to get a larger view of all the available patterns. I select this one. Now you can click any of the individual blocks to customize as you want it to be. Let's transform into the product information. This is the media text block. It allows you to place an image or a video side by side with text. So this is the idea block to showcase my product. Hi highlight the title and I change it to tomato juice. You can also switch to show the media to the right by clicking on the icon. To undo, you can use Ctrl Z shortcut or use this icon at the top. Hit Enter key to add a paragraph block. I paste in the price and the information about shipping, right? And paste in the product description. To add a new block below the spacer block, hit the Enter key. This time I want to insert the social media block. I search or enter the slash forward key, start typing to add various social media icons to your post or page with links. Just insert each social media icon, press the plus icon, Search for Twitter, Facebook, YouTube. To insert your account, press each one and insert your link and press enter. You can move or left or right, just select the first the icon you want to move and then select the icon to move. There you go. The only thing left now is to change the button. Highlight the text and change the text to buy now. Let's change the image focal point. Just drag this little point picker and there you go. Let's insert testimonials into this page. Come over here, click on the plus icon. Search for columns block. This one. Select the top level column and change to wide width. What I want to do now is to add colors to this column block. Move over to the column tab. Just select the gradient tab. Then click on these little boxes and choose your colors and adjust the colors angle. I go with these ones to match my brand colors. Inside there, click again on the plus icon and insert testimonial. This comes from the single testimonial plugin. This is a simple but helpful plugin. In the user information layout, you can determine the user information position to left, center or right. I disable the avatar. Duplicate the block and then drag it to the right column. You could insert more blocks to your product page. I just want to keep it simple for this demo. That's pretty good. Let's preview on the front end. I don't like the spacer block above the title, so I went back to the WordPress editor, select the block and delete it. The last thing we're gonna need to do is to set up the button for my simple product. So move over to the plugins tab and add a new. And then do a search for accept stride payments. 
click once to install and then once more to activate the plugin. Under the Stripes tab and settings you need to enter here your Stripe API credentials. I have already set up my single product under the Products tab. You don't need to fill in anything, the details have been pulled in. You just need to grab the product link and then paste it inside the bottom. So copy this link, open the page and paste in the bottom block link. Let's have the final run through of what we did. There we go, a simple way to make a single product sales page only with Gutenberg blocks. You can even change the quantity, it's automatically updated. As you can see, it's super easy to create your single product sales page only with Gutenberg blocks. If you have any questions, please leave them on the comment section below. I will do my best to help you. If you enjoyed the video, please take a second to subscribe to the channel. It's free, it means a lot to me and it only takes one second. Don't forget to smash the bell icon so you get notified when I release new content.